making her way to the ring from Queens, New York, Stephanie! Guys, we talk so often about having a killer instinct, but this woman needs something even darker than that tonight. Indeed, Michael, you need to tap into something sinister, something primal. You are essentially putting them inside the object of their demise. Which begs the question, does this woman have the capacity to do just that tonight? A competitor who is always laser focused on the competition. I expect big things from her tonight. The following contest is a casket match. There are no pinfalls, submissions, disqualifications, or countouts. The only way to win is for a superstar to force their opponent inside of the casket. After closing the casket lid shut, the remaining superstar will be declared the winner. Now, let the One of the most sinister matches in our industry. In order to win this match, you have to force your opponent into the casket and trap him inside. This match is not for the faint of heart. Just to get in the ring for this kind of contest takes a ton of guts. Well, there's no count outs or disqualification in this match, so running away is still a viable strategy at this point. She's taking things to ringside. Into the ring again. Oh, my! Oh. 
Reversal. Can they go on the attack? Oh, no. Into the casket. Close the lid, and it's over. Doing their best. To and they got out of the casket. Thankfully. No count out as she takes this fight to the floor. Absolutely no telling what's underneath the ring tonight. Bat in hand, stepping up to the plate indeed. He's going under the ring now. I have a feeling she has bad intentions for that chair. She steers clear of that one. There's a Russian leg sweep. Uh, just raining down punches. I think rage took over in that moment. Nothing but blind rage. Corey, an important aspect of this casket match is going to be spatial awareness. You have to stay aware of where the casket is at all times. Both so you can avoid getting sent into the casket and so it's right where you need it when the opportunity presents itself. <laughs> A collision like that could mark a turning point for this entire match. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, she is really showing her confidence. Mm -hmm. Muscled into the casket. Close the lane, win this thing, win it! Desperate. I believe they actually made it out of the casket. Taking this outside. This could be good. Oh, taking a nasty hit from a flying chair. Attacking the foot. Oh, that hurts. She's forced onto the defensive now. Look at her, taking in all the energy from the crowd. <laughs> what a forearm! Uh oh! Reversal! Can she capitalize? <laughs> oh no, this one's as good as done. Darkness is soon to follow. Trying to... They did it! They survived for now! They're gonna be breathing a sigh of relief. Clearly hoping something nefarious is beneath the ring. A shovel? Don't use a shovel! Beating down with a shovel. Straight pummeling them with it. Attacks are spelling nothing but trouble. These are the kinds of attacks that can put a superstar on the shelf for a long time. And he's getting downright nastier and nastier with each of these attacks. Oh, look at this. Oh, kicks. Three, turn your lights up. Ooh, head by hook. Nothing pretty about that. Now is as good a time as any to capitalize and get them into the casket. Yeah, but it's not going to be easy. They are completely out right now. <laughs> Jumping knee strike. Oh, like that.
has swung to her favor. Momentum has clearly swung her way. Taking it to the floor. What's she going to do? And back into the ring she goes. And it looks like she wants to take this match outside. Superstar. How the hell did they survive? Now looking for something to waylay her opponent with. Oh no, a sledgehammer. Better call the paramedics right now. Now it's in palm strikes. There are plenty of ways battling in this area could end in serious harm. Isolating the foot, DDT. All right, back to it, returning to the ring. Taking it outside the ring now. She slips outside, what has she got in mind? Oh no, not with the back. Hold on. Golly. Into a ripcord lariat. What a combination. The challenge now is to carry the dead weight. Tossed into the casket. It's about to get very dark in there. Trying to close the lid. Trying. This is going to be tough. It's not over yet. And they're able to fight their way out of the casket. They can't be human. That's ridiculous. With no count outs, there's nothing keeping her inside the ring. Clearly thinking a steel chair is what's needed right about now. Escape just in time. Ooh. Oof, smack by the back fist. Ugh, gets put into the barricade. Ow. Knew what was coming there. And I ask, the way these combatants have been unloading on one another, how are they still going? I think they're running on pure adrenaline alone now. Up into the torture rack. Oh! Feast your eyes! Might have just created a big opening. Now get over to the casket. Well-placed knees to the hamstring. Run out of ringside and back to the mat. Oh, bashing the grounded opponent with that shovel. Absolutely savage. And momentum is fading away from her. Yeah, she's being met with a roadblock every time. <laughs> this packed house is going absolutely nuts. They don't want this match to end. Trying to force the casket close to end this thing. There's no way they're going to prevent Doomsday here. Close call. 
call for that superstar. How the hell did they survive? Outside of the ring now. What's the plan here? Raven that chair and her opponent has got to be cautious now. Oh! Ouch. Oh, man! These are dangerous attacks on their own, but now the damage is exponentially multiplying. She avoids the attack completely. Driven into the barricade. Uh-oh. Oh, and she turns it around. This could be big. Big headbutt. Will this be it? Is it the opportunity she's been looking for? For all the mortician, we got a casket to fill. Ah, uh, took off the, uh, the hood of the announce table. Yes. Now there go the monitors. Sad intentions in mind here. Come on, Byron, get in front of me. No. Perhaps looking for some kind of equalizer here. Once she gets going with that kendo stick, this match could be over real fast. <laughs> and a big boot. And now she's setting the pace of this match. Yeah, she just seems unstoppable at this point. Gosh, what a match. <laughs> oh, knee to the jaw. She goes back inside the ropes. She wants to take this one outside the ring, it seems. She has the whole outside to play with. Trying to close the lid. Trying. This is going to be tough. It's not over yet. Not ready to put the lid on this one yet. Apparently closing that casket is easier said than done. And this one might be headed ringside. Seen a malicious string of attacks right now. Being put into a perilous position here after each of these vicious attacks. This is just getting uncomfortable at this point. And it is clear the mission now is to destroy and incapacitate. This is getting more and more alarming with each uninterrupted attack. Just dead weight right now. So what do you do with dead weight, Saxton? You put it in a casket. She's finally able to slow all that incoming offense. She was getting grinded down, but that could have just started a quick turnaround. Ooh. And the energy in here is raising the hairs on the back of my neck. Yeah. 
Set up for a second time. And, and the casket is waiting. Can she capitalize on the opening? Just carrying the opposition anywhere they want. <laughs> and that was an efficient display of offense with that maneuver. <laughs> Expected that one. This one's close to over. Can they get him? Yeah, into the casket. Close the lid. Well, we've got a struggle on our hands to close the casket. They may survive. They're fighting back. And they got out of the casket. Thankfully. Climbs back inside. Using the ropes. Oh, into the casket they go! Oh no, rest in pieces. Desperately trying to force the casket closed. Their opponent showing massive... Re and finally, it's over! Fade to black. Here is your winner, 